r slash white people twitter warming now says take a guess included photo harry mikhail says the really odd thing is that in the rest of the world unions laborers and working people tend to vote for the likes of labor and social democrats on the left Mirica, let's vote for that bunch of billionaires on the right, they care for me. Krugerlud2 says. Most of the world doesn't have such a strong right wing media 24 over 7 telling people lies, also Mirica loves fake Christians leaders telling them who to hate. So most red states love to vote against their own interests. Gunter5 says. That's my conclusion as well. The tight grip of media. I work with a bunch of right wingers, they repeat all the talking points all the time. we register 84 says. Crazy how education seems to ameliorate stupidity. It's almost as if you have critical thinking skills you're less likely to be swayed by an orange cult leader promising you bullshit he can't deliver, by blaming minorities who aren't responsible. Novice or Dissex says. Education isn't intelligence, but. It helps. Steely Dave says. I want to see Trump say ameliorate. Tallman11282 says. It's almost as if when people leave their insular hometowns and go somewhere with a diverse group of people, that they learn these other people aren't so different after all, and aren't the bujim and the right paints them as. That they are just trying to survive like everyone else. This is also why sitters tend to skew more liberal, because sitters tend to be more diverse. R slash white people twitter. Real world 123 says. Boo woo woo him please. Included photo. Hachit Barito says. I mean. Libertarians are still the people who never grew past having their minds blown in freshman philosophy 101, and think that trying to make floating city-states on old cruise ships is a great plan, but yeah. This was a bit of a win for them. Congrats not being the most ludicrous and poorly informed people in the room for once. Related, I have a feeling the enormous dumpy taint licking chud that runs the NH Libertarian Party Twitter is probably not stoked about this. Punch says. They boo him here, but I bet they still vote for him in November. Libertarians are just Republicans with extra steps. Knock up for you says. Libertarians are worse than Republicans but yeah, good they hate Trump too. Imma, frick, in liar says. One person who held up a sign reading no one ape dictators was dragged away by security. Wish it was Salomon says. For those who haven't heard yet, Trump begged for their votes, and said he would put some liberalist on his cabinet if he won. r slash white people twitter. Real world 123 says. You mean like the KKK? Or proud boys? Oath keepers? Five percenters? Included photo. JBCMH81 says. Trump's continued existence is strong proof for the lack of any god. Or at least of a benevolent god. Stritch says. Every. Accusation. It's. A. Confession. Planellock Smith 6714 says. Why is he still alive? Mitchson says. More MAGA projection. Bubbly Measurement 61 says. A domestic terrorist calling migrants terrorists. Pastel Butcher Knife says. My mom legitimately believes this. Admiral Landiva says. It's the three percenters, but their math and historical knowledge is frick it up, so I guess it doesn't really matter. Hot Stacks Off Wax says. He would let this country burn to the ground, if he could be king of the ashes. And it's hard to imagine, but his rhetoric and threats will get worse and worse the closer to the election we get. 
I'm anticipating violence, the more desperate and aggressive he gets the more they will also. And I'm positive he is counting on, and welcoming that violence. R slash white people twitter. Rainbow Tickler, real nurse says. Removed by reddit. Removed by reddit on account of violating the, content policy, slash help slash content policy. Right square bracket. Random Lurker 233 says. Great, now do chair ratchet. Rainbow Tickler, real nurse says. I hope he does. Should sue for a lot of money that piece of trash is backed by big money. Zombie13a says. Should sue instead to make libs of TikTok publicly admit that they shared an altered video for the purposes of defaming the person and for age bait. Make her eat crow publicly and in front of her followers. Look away 123 says. That chair lady is dangerous. She's a single childless person who is obsessed with children's genitals and who actively spends her time searching for news of children being sexually violated. She's a pervert who should never be allowed around children. Keep suing these freaks into bankruptcy. Photoshopping and sharing pictures of children in unsafe sexual situations for pleasure and spite is some frick, ed up loser pedophile shit. Keep kids away from conservatives. r slash white people twitter octavid777 says glitch national embarrassment donald trump stands at attention and salutes the song amazing grace at nascar event included photo octavid777 says hmm I wonder what MAGA media would say, if Sleepy Joe Biden saluted during a bagpipe rendition of Amazing Grace? Thetrath Talker 800 says. It's more depressing than anything this guy has a cult of 42% of people who will approve of him no matter if he literally kissed their wives in front of them, fantasizes about his own daughter romantically, has 91 felonies, is a convicted sexual abuser in the E. Jane case, and is a traitor to his own nation selling secrets to Australian businessmen and likely Putin related to. Trump being reflective of a lot of the us, at least half, is even worse this country has major major issues to want him to be president again. String Fartet says. 36% hardcore never changed. 36% of the voting population. Been that way from the start 2015. And the scary part, that's enough to win an election with gerrymandering and the electoral college. Anthropomorphization says. Weird. A guy in orange macup is a clown. Thetrath Talker 800 says. I wish he were a clown, but he's not funny. The man is probably the third most dangerous high profile politician in the US today, and could be a lifelong dictator or the man who causes the US to balkanize and secede into different territories for the first time since the 1850s and the 2020s. This is not a joke. String Fartet says. The amount of stupid shit this guy does, and still people think he is intelligent. He is not intelligent. He would not be intelligent in a room full of 5th graders. A room full of 3rd graders is up for debate. Stares at an eclipse. Thinks sunshine up the ass, and ingesting bleach will cure covid. Stop a hurricane with a nuclear attack over the Atlantic Ocean. Use a sharpie to change a Noah hurricane map. He wanted to buy Greenland and thought that was a possibility. California should prevent forest fires by raking their forests. He tried to taunt the North Korean leader into nuclear war. Mentioned the airports during the American Revolution. Don't get me started on his Jettisburg speech. His favorite Bible quote? All of them. Person, woman, man, camera, TV hamburgers and cub thief. Windmills. The guy had to get in a golf cart instead of walk 100 yards with world leaders. You could add to this list all day. Frickin' stable genius. r slash white people twitter. 
unembellishing says. Transphobe from the we can always tell crowd correctly genders trans male drag queen. Included photo. Unembellishing says. Context, a contestant on RuPaul's Drag Race All Stars 9, Gottmik, is a trans man who did a runway look, based on her gender transition, and getting top surgery, pictured above. Conservatives in the comments unilaterally think she is a CI's man who is mocking women's pain. Most people in the fandom will refer to any queens in drag with she slash her pronouns, and there are several many comments from conservatives correcting the pronouns are used to he slash him, not knowing got mixed gender assigned at birth, and thereby accidentally gendering her correctly out of drag. Savannah says. I'm a few years from 40, suffered with chronic pain and disabling conditions all my life, and in my experience conservatives have never once cared about women's pain. I've never once heard one of them address the fact that women's pain isn't taken as seriously as men's. They have consistently fought to keep child marriage legal. They take away our medical care and force women without health care to bear children nobody can afford, and won't even give them access to daycare, so they can work. Conservatives don't care about women. I've met a lot of drag queens that do. Unembellishing says. I'm sorry you've dealt with that. I'm not a woman, but what I've seen the many lovely women in my life go through has mirrored your experience. Sending love and light your way. Deneth says. It's always been about policing women's appearances. That's it. That's the entire game. Frostichica says. Trans drag queens are powerful enough to be immune to misgendering, slash J just in case, if you say he, you're talking about pre-drag transformation Brian, and if you say she, you're talking about Miss Diamond Rose the drag queen. Spire Citron says. Yeah, that's the funny thing. There isn't really an option you can go for here that's inherently offensive, unless you want to go for it. But they'll still try. Last percentage 5062 says. Fam, the symbolism is pretty obvious, if they knew basically anything about trans people, they would understand, but they don't. And pretend they do. That's all for this video thank you for watching please subscribe.